Good afternoon. For those who are new, I'm Dr. Theron Sherman, and in today's briefing, we will be studying SCP-6306. There isn't any objectionable material in this document, so let's begin. Item Number SCP-6306 Classification Level 1 Unrestricted Containment Class Neutralized Special Containment Procedures the remains of SCP-6306 have been properly disposed of. Dr. Weddle is to report further incidents correlating with SCP-6306 if they occur. Description: SCP-6306 was an A4 size sheet of paper formerly belonging to Dr. W. Weddle. It contained various New Year's resolution goals, though the exact contents of SCP-6306 have yet to be disclosed, as Dr. Weddle refused to elaborate on the written desires he planned to fulfill the coming year. While SCP-6306 itself was not anomalous, the circumstances surrounding its sudden neutralization warranted its SCP designation. It is unknown whether the incident involving SCP-6306 was caused by an unidentified third party or SCP-6306 itself. Dr. Weddle has prohibited any further exploration into the anomalous makeup of SCP-6306, due to it being, quote, unnecessary. Incident 6306-1 the following is a transcription of the events immediately leading to and after SCP-6306's abrupt nullification. Recording Log Date December 31st, 2021 to January 1st, 2022 Forward Footage taken from security cameras implemented within Dr. Weddle's office. Footage begins. Dr. Weddle is seated in his office chair, skimming through SCP-6306's contents faintly smiling. He takes a sip from his coffee mug while still holding on to SCP-6306. At the stroke of midnight, a spark is seen on the bottom left corner of SCP-6306 before it suddenly catches on fire. Notably, this occurred exactly at midnight. Dr. Weddle sees this, and accidentally chokes on his coffee as he steps from his desk, leaving SCP-6306 resting on top and kicking away his seat as it slides across the room. Dr. Weddle appears confused. Dr. Weddle swears under his breath as he notices the coffee stain on his lab coat, before turning his attention to SCP-6306. He gradually approaches it before throwing it on the floor and repeatedly stomping on it. Despite this, the fire does not subside and continues spreading throughout SCP-6306. Dr. Weddle sighs, putting his hands on the back of his neck before swiftly exiting his office. Five minutes later, Dr. Weddle returns with a fire extinguisher and attempts to extinguish the fire once more. <coughs> he coughs and closes his eyes. He eventually succeeds. However, SCP-6306 is entirely disintegrated before the flames were put out. Dr. Weddle sets down the fire extinguisher off-camera. A message composed of SCP-6306's ashes remains, reading, as if you'd fulfill them anyway. Dr. Whittle stares at this for a brief moment, before leaving the room to retrieve a dustpan and brush. The rest of the recording shows him silently sweeping the ash and discarding it in the trash bin. Footage ends. Afterward, Dr. Whittle filed a request to take the rest of the day off. Request was accepted. As of writing, Dr. Whittle has made no attempt to redraft his New Year's resolution plans. Thank you for listening. Site42 Studios and its staff are funded by viewers like you. Please become a patron or visit our merch store at the link in our bio to support our work. Secure. Contain. Protect.